There's no obligation to buy. We're looking for the Leo volume of the Tibet Travel Guide. Do you have it in stock? Sorry, dear. We stopped stocking that a very long time ago. Huh? But the Mondstadt volume was... The thing is, the author made it too personal, and the result wasn't really much of a guide. It barely sold any copies, and the few travelers that did buy it made complaints afterward. Well, that's a shame. The Mondstadt volume was a good read. The fact remains that I don't have it in stock. If you must read it, try your luck. Who's Ching the Nun? A book collector who lives in Qingse Village. He's a complete grouch. But he, he was a regular customer here back when he lived in Liyue Harbor. And I still sent him the odd odd. Did somebody say out of print books? Is there a chance that Volume 6 of Legend of the Shattered Halberd is also in his collection? Apologies, my liege. Where are my manners? My name is Sing Cho. Since you and I are both in search of lost books, what say we travel together to Mount Qingse and pay a visit to Ch- My pleasure, fellow book lover! Should we ask here if they have a copy of the Leo volume of the Tevat Travel Guide? It's super duper interesting! So, are you buying or not? Heavens are smiting me. Smite? Uh huh. And what do you want? We've heard you've got tons of old books lying around, and we want to borrow the Leo. Huh. Don't get me started on the. T After the chasm was sealed off, to pay off my debts, I had no choice but to pawn off my beloved book collection. Every last book. Do you have. Wrong. That was my life's work. I devoted my entire life to. <sighs> It's you. Unless you have other business here, I'm done talking to you. Goodbye. Off you go. Please tell me that you didn't pawn Volume 6 of Legend of the Shattered Halberd. Legend of the Shattered Halberd? <laughs> there is a title I haven't heard. What? But we don't? That work was an epic defining masterpiece. Granted, it was... But over time, it was the work that came to define the genre of martial arts. Barely any copies of the first edition were ever printed. The later edition inexplicably went out of print, almost as soon as it was released. A shame. 
given what it allegedly added to... Yes, that's right. How did I forget? The original edition, sixth volume of that work is... is... You mean... you mean you still have it? Yes. It is my... Hey, Chang. You've got some nerve keeping me and my boss waiting like this. I need an answer. Will you sell the Corlapis or not? I'm sure you don't need me to remind you that if you met... Oh, you again? But you know I can't afford to give a 70% discount on the price. I... That's your business. The question is, do you want your books or do you want food on your plate? Perhaps you like... Uh. Whoa there, friend. Come on. This gentleman is either willing to make a deal or he's not. You can't force him to sell against his... Just who do you think you are? <laughs> My liege, I am but one who comes to the aid of this gentleman in his moment of need. I am Tsingcho. <laughs> <laughs> Gu Hua clan? Did you hear this clown? He thinks he's a Gu Hua master. <laughs> oh, there was me thinking the last granddads of Gu Hua killed over and died by now. <laughs> Who were you supposed to be then, huh? Some sort- Justice is blind to our backgrounds, my friend. That just makes me someone trying to do the right thing. Get a load of this guy. <laughs> just you and you, Chang. You're selling that core lapis whether you like- <sighs> Oh, how the wolves prey upon the fallen tiger. So, just to come back to what we were talking about earlier, could I get a yay or nay about borrowing that book? Oh, what does it matter now? I can't expect anybody to care about me anymore. But since you did... Three long years I have waited for this day. Words cannot express my gratitude. All right, give it a rest. Just bring it back when you're finished. Sorry, but I'm not about to put my hopes... Hey, where are you going? We've still got... Now I can get back everything I lost. Reading, huh, Mr. Ho oh, ho, amazing! I never. Hello, Shincho? No wonder this book is so highly sought after. <sighs> How can they bully poor old Chang the Knife like this? Forcing him to sell his ore for dirt cheap? It's daylight robbery, pure and simple! Don't forget me. I'm in two. Oh, so now you can... The reason I borrowed this book is that it would be a real pity if Chang the Ninth ended up having to... And I meant every word I said to Chang the Ninth. I will return his act of kindness. It is the just thing to do. I will be custodian of this book. And I will also help find a way to buy back the rest of his collection. Of course I do. An initial plan, anyway. Uh, give me a second to reflect. It shan't take... You're still here? What is this, a game to you? You think no one's re- <laughs> I gotta hand it to the goofball clan. When you lack in numbers and talent, you may- Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say goofball clan? I'm- There's a saying that goes, the insect that shakes the oak tree ludicrously overestimates its ability. Uh, quit quoting proverbs at me, you buffoon. Please leave this place. I will not tolerate an attempt to coerce an honest traitor. Especially when- <sighs> It's cute that you want to stick your neck up, but you picked the wrong time, you little punk. I brought the Fatui to back me up. A whole army of you and your little Guhua buddies wouldn't be able to help you. I may be young, my liege, but the path I have chosen makes me no stranger to conflict. Why should I cower in the face of evil? Oh, great speech. <laughs> Are you here to oh. <laughs> Over here! <clears throat>
That was just a regular pendant you were wearing, not a vision. You won this round, but you better watch your back. This isn't over. Would it be too much to hope they've learned their lesson? No, no, you misunderstand. That fellow has a foul mouth, to be sure. But his assessment of the state of the Guhua clan is... Though I long to restore Guhua to its former glory. They've gone for now, but they'll be back looking to cause more trouble. I'll see to it that no harm comes to those who show me kindness. There is a... It's not like the Fatui to pick sides in a bit. There must be a deeper level of Kalu... He mentioned Gentry Maltai. I know this name. He has a stately residence in Liyue Harbor. That idea works, but... Me? I have other things to look into. Let me see. You really have stuff to do? Are you sh Wow. So that's how that turned out. This whole passage is just... extraordinary. Ugh. This guy is so annoying. <laughs> Fine. But, as per tradition, Paimon gets to pick an ugly nickname for him. From now on, he shall be known as... <gasps> Guhua Geek. Master finds out. Who goes there? Really? He didn't mention anything about the Master's dealing with some urgent business today. Urgent business? <sighs> the Master's been working on a major business deal recently. He left. So, when. I'm sorry. The Master is stressed that we must not dis. Uh, no! I, I, I mean, yes. Yes, you are. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Master's currently in business. I, I beg for your mercy. Please. My master will- Well, my master has much- Luckily for you, your bad attitude will be the last thing on his mind when he's busy negotiating a big business deal with your boss. Thank you, thank you. May your business forever be blessed, but- Nice work! Paimon never knew you were such a tough negotiator. Is that so? Now Paimon knows not to- Anyway, seems like the VIP client in question must be one of the Fatui. In that case, let's get ourselves over- Seems business is booming at the Shinua kiosk. No one should- But either way, if we want to know what kind of shady business they're up to, we better be careful. I understand. I do. Please, do not worry. You have my word that the order will be completed as promised. Hmm. The subordinate I sent was not quite so opt- Uh, we just ran into a minor procurement problem, is all. We haven't managed to- But it's nothing for you to worry about. If Chang then- That would be most ideal. We are willing to lend a certain degree of support to the... You may suddenly... I understand. I am indebted. We shall see when the time comes. <laughs> Darn that old man, Chang. So, Mr. Chen... Who knows if Gua Geek has made any progress? <laughs> 